All right, so there you have it, guys. That is my 1982 Epiphone Spirit II. Now, the story behind these guitars is actually that they were produced under the Epiphone moniker first, but they didn't sell, so Gibson actually blacked out the Epiphone and rebranded them Gibson, and then started selling the Gibson Spirit too. But these were actually made in Kalamazoo at the Gibson factory. As you can see, they obviously have the Gibson headstock. And this one is 100% original. It's got Tim Shaw pickups and they're in really excellent condition. This bridge, which I absolutely love, this part actually comes out and you can string it up first and then tuck it in. Uh, everything's original, obviously it's pretty beat up in some spots. If you look at the back, there's some pretty gnarly buckle rash. I already showed this guitar to you guys in one video, but I never actually demoed it. Uh, so I thought I would play it today because I have not uploaded in a while. I apologize for that. I have been busy working on my band International's new record, and I also didn't have internet at the house for a little while, so that's why I haven't uploaded much lately. Real quick before I go, YouTube made some changes to their partnership program yesterday, which is how you get paid on YouTube. And you have to have like, I think it's 4,000 hours of watch time and a thousand subscribers to be a part of the partnership program. And I am nowhere near that. Now my watch time is, my watch time is just shy, but currently I'm setting around 390 subscribers and I would need to darn near triple that in a month. So if you're not subscribed, it would be really cool of you to do so. If I don't hit it, then you know, oh well, life goes on. I enjoy making videos and I'm going to keep making them regardless of what YouTube wants to do to my channel. I really love this guitar, you guys. I do wish it had more fret to it. The frets are really, really low, which makes it kind of hard to bend on. Um, I actually bought this guitar with the idea of having it be my main guitar live, but because of the flat frets, that just doesn't work for me. Plus, I'm kind of still in love with my Jazz Master lately, so I've been playing that. As always, you guys, I really appreciate you watching. Peace. Take it easy.